It, it could it could be detrimental. I mean, we'll have to see how it starts, but I'm gonna give the edge to Mackie Allen. Obviously, safe choice. Yeah, okay. You know what? This might be an interesting case of who can, like, play yeah. their character better versus who has the better team's, like, understanding synergy. Yeah. Cool yeah. This might be a good way to see which one's more valuable. Because I would say that, like... But at the same time, this is weird. Like, I, I can't really imagine a world where, like, Mac needs uh, Alan lose. Because, like, they're both, like... They're both just really good godlike in teams. They're godlike in teams, and I could argue for both of them being, like, the superior Ooh. teams or singles player, right? Maybe... Maybe uh, not Allen over face one and squid. I'm not really sure. But Mac D is like Mac D is top twenty, right? He's a top. He's a top twenty. Is player. he a top twenty player? I actually, he's like I know at least he's, top. 30. There's no way he's below top thirty. Yeah. So I, I, I think he's actually like thirteen ish. That uh -huh. general range. I, I can't really say. But yeah, like I would be really surprised. But hey, oh, at the, the moment, heck? okay. Um, so Mac D just. Let's Mac D just let's face roll back onto the edge, but then somehow still gets the kill. I'm that really blows my mind how that happened. Also, um Squid? Yeah, Squid with, with some good lasers, keeping the combo going. Yeah. But yeah, this is so clean right now. This is so um so even. I I would assume that if the blue team loses, we'll see at least one Peach come out. Yeah. Or... Most likely, uh, Mac D's Peach. Uh, maybe Double Peach? I don't really know. Okay, honestly, I'd be hyped to see Double Peach. <laughs> okay. Good coverage. I would imagine... Squid. I don't think it's their best option, but I think their best option would be probably like Peach Cheek. Like Peach Cheek? Yeah, I agree. Oh! Those needles. It, it seems like Mac D really enjoys the... Laser approach forward smash. Like if if you watch what his Falco is doing, like there's a lot <laughs> of smashes like going on. You know what I mean? Uh yeah, and I think that like you know maybe this is how he plays in singles too. But I can't. I want to imagine that like a lot of the smashes are influenced oh. by like the dynamic of teams. You know? Yeah, maybe. Like there are definitely moments where like you can just kind of catch somebody not paying attention because they're too busy comping somebody else. And also punishes in teams. I mean, depending on the position of them and their partner and uh -huh. her partner, like, you could get away with a lot of stuff. Yeah, no, for sure, for you sure. You know, also you could just get the shit beaten out of you just for doing one dumb thing. But, like, that depends on whether or not you could read the situation. And I'm sure MACD reads situations like nobody's business, you know what I mean? Yeah, okay, oh, and... Alright, this, this should be a wrap. Uh, alright. Protein wrap. Let's see some... <laughs> let's see a cool team sound though. Ooh, let's see. Let's see if they could like start cooking on this guy, on this fool. Okay, squid. Cooking on. Let's go. Yeah, put him in the crock pot. Uh, you know what I mean? Turn him into a rap. Yeah. Turn oh. him into a rap. Oh my god, dude! Can you make this? Can you make this come back, dude? The Mac Dizzle. <laughs> the Mac Falco. Oh, throw him back to your partner, bro. Oh, he's dead. Nah, there's no way, dude. Yeah, to be honest, Falco, tough. Falco like edge guard coverage against other Falcos is kind of stupid. Like. There's no way to come back if you like put the good lasers it's and then just, like you space your down air. Yeah, because because the whole deal is um, with Falco, you you mix up between going to the ledge, going to the stage. Yeah. But if you just and like, I mean that's how you get back on stage, right? You mix I, it up with like shorts and shit. Yeah. But <laughs> it's if weird. you got two people edge guarding you, covering both options, it's just so hard to get back on. Falco is, uh, he's kind of a tough character to like recover with. Because like all of his mix-ups, they come only when you're above the stage or when you're really, really close to the ledge. And when you're really close to the ledge, it doesn't really matter if you're trying to mix them up. They can just kill you, you know? Speaking of just killing Falcos, okay. Face Roll just took that MACD stock. Like Alright, so Squid and Face Roll, they're sticking... Yeah. Or no, not Squid and Face Roll. Uh, MACD Alan. and Alan, they're sticking with this Falco. You know... Alan D. I don't know what their opinions on Falco and teams are. Maybe, you know? Oh, um, yeah. <laughs> maybe, I mean, like. I'm sure Falco's a viable team's character. Maybe Macdy being, like, the team's specialist, he is, like, see some, like, brokenness to Falco and teams. Yeah. Or maybe they're really just trying to do some this for fun. <laughs> yeah, I mean, also, it's, like, winners. Yeah. I, like, if they're really confident, which they have every right to be, honestly, in their, in their like, double peach or, like, peach chic. Team comps, they, they could like afford to, you know, gain some data. Just drop the set? Yeah, drop drop a set, why not? You know? Man, I hate dropping sets though, dude. Like, just in terms of pure light. I'd always want to win through winners for the sake of like... To just shut up the haters? Just, nah, just, <laughs> just win through the fucking, like, winners. You know, it saves everyone a lot of time. Like, I don't want to reset the bracket. 
Like, yeah, you're right. Come on. Oh, whoa. What was that? Was that a mix up? Oh, uh, <laughs> I'm. It, it lets you recover a little bit fast because, like, Zelda falls slower and moves through the air faster than she. Okay, well, it seemed like a pretty good mix up. Face roll had the ledge, and so there's yeah. no way he could have, like, like, you know, hit Zelda up there. Yeah, so. there it is. Ooh, he's dead. Oh. But once again. Okay, you know what? I'm starting to see the utility of Falco in teams. Like, there's definitely a way to play Falco like a floaty, where and it's, it can be actually really hard to like, yeah, kill him. He, because all his hitboxes are actually really strong. His hitboxes are strong. You can fade away with them. They're fast. They come out. Yeah, he's, he's really good at controlling center stage. Really good at contro and controlling space in general. You know? Yeah, like his laser is just straight godlike. If your teammate is like one v oneing on this side, yeah. on, on the left side, and then the other person is like the other member of the other team is on the right side, you could just kind of like laser them out and wall them in two v keep a two v one going. You know? Yeah. But yeah, you could just stop them from moving. Yeah, stop them from coming in and helping their teammate out, which is Stop like, them from coming in and helping their teammate out. Yeah. I think Alan just killed. Like, okay. in singles, it's kind of pointless to do that. I mean, it's not necessarily pointless. It's more of like a frustration tactic or like a positioning thing, but like, you never really just like want... There's no point of walling people out with lasers, just like, yeah. perpetually. Like, eventually they're gonna find a way in, but... Uh, in teams, I could definitely see that being a thing. Sometimes you just yeah. want more, like, time. And, like, in teams, it's not like you're stalling the match. Mm. You're stopping one person from exactly moving while your partner can, like, still It's move, going to work. You know what I mean? Uh-huh. And, like, you know, at any given time, like, it's not like they can just try to control or, like, regain center control, you know? Like, you're there. You're keeping somebody out. You have your bear, like, yeah. offensively to threaten. Okay. Oh, he's making it. Oh, okay. And he's dead. And see, I, like right there, I feel like this. Actually, I don't know. Maybe I'm just silly. But... All right, so can Alan make this comeback? Uh, Alan's this good. comeback is a reasonable comeback. Yeah, to it's, make, it's very reasonable. It, it's you know, yeah, it's not in there. It's not likely, but like it's very possible. One yeah. slap. Okay, never mind. But one slap on the on the sheik. All right. You know, Three grabs on the Falco. Let's see. Doable. Mac well, not reapplying anymore. the chapstick. Oh. Okay. See. They don't want. They don't want yeah. to have to reset. Okay? Yeah, you're right. They don't want to. Right. They don't want to have to play more sets that they know they. Oh, win. double peach. Double peach. Okay. Well, I guess okay. this is meta. Okay. So, I, so I guess they're just gonna do the thing where they both down smash a lot, maybe. Dude. Oh, okay. Like, can't jump if one of them's down smashing the side platform, one of them's down smashing below it. How are you supposed to recover? They just own that territory, uh, dude. Exactly. They just own the right side of Yoshi's. Oh no, dude. Oh no. <clears throat> this is disgusting, dude. Stop this. Dude, I feel like down smash is is too good. You know. Down smash I mean? is annoyingly it's, good. <laughs> it's, it's like so strong. It's spammable, you know, and it's not. It's like one of the few things in this game that's really spammable. Yeah. It really is. Laser is big one of them, I guess. Fox's dash dance. Yeah. <laughs> but just like, just stay just, in place. And just, just sit there and throw it out. Yeah, you'll get punished. You can't really do that with any other move. Like, it's not even like, I mean, obviously, if you only were to do that, it'd be bad. But like, as, even as far as like mix ups go, it's not uh -huh. that bad. Like, oh, I missed the F smash. I missed the down smash. All right, if you can try to punish the lag, here's another down smash. Yeah, here's okay. another down smash. Work around it. Uh -huh. I'm curious to see at the end of this game. I wish I wish this could be a thing, but I want to see like how much damage was just from down smash. Mm. You know, I want to see the Dude, the ratios. Honestly, you kind of can. Like, actually, you can't. Uh, I know that there's like you can check to see how many smash attacks were thrown out, and they're probably not yeah. using any other smash attacks without down smash. Oh, oh, squid! Whoa! To, no way! That was that was, that was nice. Amazing. That yeah. was some that was serious control right there. Yeah, that was a uh, knowledge of character, dog. All right. Speaking of knowledge of character, do you see that synchronized turnip pull, dude? This is actually really funny to watch, just because it's just oh. like these two peaches making a wall. Did you see that? How they just kind of sweeped red team to the other side? Wow, this is not even close. Yeah, uh, we're gonna. Is... Man, why don't you just do this from game one? <laughs> no, dude, because you want to see the three out of no, five. No, this is some real utter domination shit. You know, it's like, all yeah. right, now we're just gonna body. Now we're just gonna pick pick these two characters and see what's going on. But I have a feeling the strategy probably works best on this stage. <laughs> yeah, it's like because because what Peach does is you just stay kind of in this one area and you just control that area really well. You know, also get great nair, 
But like that's kind of Peach's thing. Are we gonna see Squid's uh, Jigglypuff? The double puff. Double puff. Two two puffs, one ledge. That's the name of their puff puff team. That is a Squid exasperated look on Griffin's face. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Darn, dude. How do I deal with this? But that's, that's a good question. Shenanigans. I think pick like a Falcon. Pick like a Marth. You think either of these guys have secondaries? They're like defined by their character. Yeah. Um, I'm not too sure about. I'm not Wait too sure minute. about face roll. His fox is I. Oh, but, is it? Yeah, but there's no reason to switch from Sheik, You know. Uh, maybe switch from Falco to like a Marth, someone who can like challenge the space a little bit better. Who yeah. can stop? Who can just put up a wall of his own, kind of? Like a puff would be nice. Uh, but I'm not too sure how good uh, Jeremy's puff is or Squid's puff is. <laughs> I don't think it's actually that good. I think it was just that. that I think they, he just planks a lot with yeah. another puff on the same edge. He described it to me earlier. He was just like, you have one puff uh, doing safe fares, and you have another puff grabbing the edge in between the safe fares. Okay. You know, and that, and that was his strategy. And you just try to time people out. Double down smash. Uh huh. There's like. I mean, they boot. Boot. They both do have uh, projectiles. I guess yeah. they could. Uh, I guess that's kind of the rationale behind the stage, right? But <clears throat> I mean, if but also Peach has good projectiles, also. And I would argue that turnips are more disruptive than needles. Definitely not as good as uh, lasers, but like like turnips are hella good, especially when you got two of them thro getting thrown at you. Mm. One from a platform, one from the stage. Like it's it's hard. Dude. Okay, but the. You know why I think turnips are so good? They compared to like what? All right, they're like they dip below the stage. You mm. can't do that with lasers. You can do that with needles. Oh, you can, that's the only thing you can do with action. No, never mind. You can definitely. Oh, you you should, do that with PK fire. You should be able to shoot lasers or not lasers, needles like that way. You know, like anti-air with them. That's <laughs> that'd be cool. That would suck, dude. <laughs> I feel like sick. that would just really suck. Or like you could just control the direction of the needle. Yeah. You know? Like an upbeat? Yeah, yeah. Like a Falco's upbeat? <laughs> like, there's like, oh, there's like 360 angles you could throw the needles. Squid has been getting these, uh, like, platform cancel stuff pretty good. Don't be down there, bro. You don't want to go down there. Oh, you see, he's dead. Platform oh, cancel safe! Cool. Safe from face roll. Wow, the power sports. Exercise him. Wow. Exercise him. Get it? Like, exorcise, but exercise. <laughs> Anyways, sure. good up air. Wow, red team. Up. With a solid lead, maybe Alan and Mac D will uh, kind of regret what they were doing earlier, sandbagging with uh, Sheik Falco. They, they should. I hate sandbagging. I mean, is it sandbagging or is it... Well, they got bodied in the first two games. Or is it data collection, you know what I mean? Uh, data collection that you can't do with your secondaries. Good enough. You probably knew that before. Uh, I don't yeah. know. Oh, uh, whatever, dude. I guess so, I guess get so. To see more Miller, I mean, right? this is 20XX, an SB Odyssey. It's yeah. not Genesis 3. <laughs> it ain't Genesis. <laughs> this is our goddamn Smash Odyssey, dude. Ooh. Do you know what that is, SR? Um, I think that's uh, the name of the... That's our stream. Oh, okay. Sim slight... Uh, I... I... Uh, soft, soft, reset. soft Reset. Okay, yeah, yeah. I've definitely... I'm... I'm uh, I follow them. <laughs> yeah, same. I follow basically every major stream in SoCal, I think. Support your local streamers, man. Support? Yeah, for real. Seriously? Gimmer, he's got... He's got too much clout, I think. He's he doesn't let... Much clout? Yeah, he doesn't let anyone else grow. You know Chibo? Yeah. Killed that man. Alright, in that man's career. <laughs> Alright, when's the last time you heard of Chibo? He used Ooh, to be like... A while. They used to like... You know, like... They're both in competition for hosting the really, really big events. Yeah, they were. It was now, like CTVG. Yeah, PC, CT right? and VG. Now it's just VG. Showdown Smash is really good. Showdown I hear Smash is legit. The okay. SP, I hear the, uh, sorry, not SP, uh, the Smash tutorials stream is really good. Uh, also, this is I would disagree. They have like the world's worst overlay. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> but, okay, just kidding. I said this was going to be a hard comeback. Uh -huh. I take it back. All right, you know what I think? I'm it, not it's very doable. Like... Hard it's, to oh, kill it's, Peach. It's very doable. I mean, because like it's hard for Falco to kill Peach at this percent, right? Yeah. No, I, and, honestly. And Sheik can do it, but then also the Sheik is a high percent. And if the Sheik dies, then it's kind of scary. You know what I think is a really, really good tool that Peach has in the one v one? The forward throw. You know? Forward throw? Oh, that's it's so the, good. It's so good at just separating. People. You slap them. Slap them away. You instantly. slap two people for the price of one. Exactly. Dude. 
He oh, was like, hold this. Oh my gosh, is this gonna happen? And this, right, you know? We got chokes. We got chokes? Right now? It's like, this is just S. Okay, no. Oh. Yeah, Alright, so squid face roll. Uh, squid face roll? Definitely close it out. Good stuff. Now they're gonna be winning in grands. No, that was like really. Oh. Yeah, now, now they're gonna be winning in grands. I feel like this is how it should be six kills and